Also, I cut my sides way too freaking short. <laughs> Yo, what is up everybody? I am Ami Yoshiko. Welcome to my channel if you're new here, or welcome back to my channel, Mother Freaker! Today we are back at it again, Ow. Okay. Today we are back at it again with another Twisted Wonderland update video. Also, I'm still sick. Every other week I'm freaking sick. I don't even know why. Yes, I do. I take shit care of myself. <laughs> but yes, another dormitory has been released for the mobile game by Disney Japan, Twisted Wonderland. And if you have no idea what I'm talking about, make sure to check out my other videos where I go into more depth about the actual plot and more information about the game. So make sure to check out those previous videos. I will leave those in the description. But I will insert right here the general summary of the game that I did in my last update video and I'll um, do that, I'm 32 now. You, the protagonist, goes through a magic mirror and ending up in this world known as Twisted Wonderland. Upon entering, you are faced with the headmaster of the prestigious magic training school known as Ninth Raven College, which this college has seven dormitories, each of them inspired by a different Disney franchise. And as I suspected, a hoe was right. I freaking said it was gonna be Aladdin. Guess who was right? This hoe. This hoe was right. Baby! I was fucking right. And on last month's episode update video, in the mirror, it showed May 24th with sand in the background. And at first, some other people assumed that it might just be for the aerial theme. That was the past month, but I was like, this is fucking Aladdin. And I didn't even know this. A lot of you guys were writing in the comments that May 24th is the actual release date of Aladdin, the live action movie. So when I saw those comments, I'm like, huh, yeah, it kind of makes sense that it would be Aladdin, and Poe was right! This month's released college theme for the Twisted Wonderland game is Aladdin. Once you enter the website, you are swept away by a huge sandstorm and brought to the homepage. Also, who's seen the Aladdin movie? Let me know if it's any good. Aladdin is probably one of my favorite Disney movies. Once we go down, we see the other colleges that were previously announced, and now we have this new college entering the field, and that is called Scarabia. But I think it looks hecka cool. And for this college, sadly, there was only two new released tenants. However, both equally as gorgeous, so it ain't that bad. First, we have Kalim al Asim. I'm sorry if I butchered these and they sound bad. I'm sorry. I'm doing my best. Born from a wealthy family and a very generous young man. And he will be voiced by Furuta Kazuki, who, instead of voice acting, is more known for his on stage performances, such as playing Ryoma Echizen in the Prince of Tennis anime on stage musical play Tenimu, as well as performing as Kazuma Hashimoto in the anime on stage play of Cheer Danshi, as well as other more traditional media by appearing in several Japanese films and TV series, such as Precious Stone. Shoji Ide in The Good Wife, and Kiss Me You. And this character also spent most of his childhood with the deputy director of the Scarabia dormitory, Jamil Viper. And his ancestors served under the Kalim family for generations. And he has served under the Kalim clan, specifically Kalim Al-Asim, from a very young age. And he will be voiced by Futaba Kaname, who is also more known for his on-stage performances, such as playing the sharp-eyed tennis player, Sayyid Kojiro in the third season of the Prince of Tennis anime onstage musical play, Seigaku vs. Rokaku. Kinda broke my heart that there were only two, but they're both beautiful, and I love the Arabian aesthetic. And remember that this is not an Otome game, this is an adventure mobile game app, and also I've read stuff on Twitter and other forums, so to clarify here that these are not Ginjinka of any official Disney characters, all these characters are originally designed by Yana Toboso. <laughs> And if you don't remember, is the creator and mangaka of Black Butler. I've seen that a lot of people are thinking that these characters are like anime versions of Jafar, or anime versions of these Disney characters, but it is not. These are more of interpretations and influences based off the Disney film. And if you look on the website now into the magic mirror, you see that now there is a green bubbly ooly gooly, witchy, boil, and troubly. I don't know what I'm saying. You will see that the next update is June 27th. And by the witch's cauldron, who do you think will be next? I have guesses that maybe it's Sleeping Beauty related because of the witch and 
Did she poison her? Maybe Snow White, because I remember in that little trailer that they did show Snow White. Maybe it's an interpretation of the poisoned apple, maybe. But if you have any ideas on what you think the next Disney themed dormitory will be, let me know in the comments, because I'm curious and I want to know if there's any other Disney ones I'm missing that probably could have made this very obvious. But thank you guys so much for watching, and before we go, we got a showstopper to announce. Emergency! Emergency! In the building. So it is like 5 a.m. right now. No, I did not sleep. For those who are DMing me to sleep, no, the answer is no. I finished editing this video forever ago, and I was looking on the site, and look what I bloody see. Holy! You see the Twitter notification on the bottom of the website, and lord my god. I'm gonna freaking lose it. I'm trying not to be loud because it's like 5 a.m. and my my family's gonna kill me. But I like had to stop everything. I'm like, no, no, no. I, I can't freaking upload this video now. So the game usually updates once a month in like the 20s, but I don't know where. Like literally like two hours ago, they decided to release the first teacher of Night Raven College and. Holy crap. The first teacher that is released of the Night Raven College is Divas Cruel, which if you can't tell by the iconic black and white hair and fur coat, this is a take on Cruella de Vil from 101 Dalmatians. And I'm losing my shit cause this man is fine. Holy crap. I bet this fucker is wearing the best heels the best high heel boots. Please step on me, Cruella. I, I'm fucking gross, I know, I know. I literally freaked out on my Instagram story cause this, this shit's good. And I'm like, just prepare for some like bullshit editing cause it's 5 a.m. I'm not at home so I'm not gonna be able to freaking record so I'm just gonna do some bullshit right now. Divas Cruel, teacher at Night Raven College, he is in charge of the science subjects such as magic pharmacy. And when it comes to fashion, one side cannot see the surroundings, whatever the freak that means. He looks so fine. Oh my god, can I just get, could I just get every guy cosplayer, boy, girl, whatever, to just go ham on this, please? I need this man. I need him real, and I need him in my life. Now. And first of all, look at the freaking spoke pipe. Can we talk about how there's a freaking collar? Like, you went to some freaking kinky shit, bro. <laughs> I'm kidding! Oh my god! And the, the earring, oh my god, the earring kills me. The hair, lord, give me strength, I cannot. And the voice actor for Divis Cruel is Kento Ito. And he, oh my god, I love this man so much. He voices Hirotaka Nifuji from one of my favorite animes, Wotaku ni Koi wa Muzukashi. That is a hilarious anime. If you have not seen it, check it out. I wanted to make a video called Top 5 Animes You Can Fangirl To As An Adult, and this one's at the top of my list. And he also voices Michio Hazama from Idolmaster. Damn. Please step on me with your boots, Cruella. Holy crap. But, um, yeah, sorry for this bullshit little editing at the end. I was just fangirling too much about this character. It's not enough info for a video all on its own. And this video was gonna go out today, so, um, yeah, this is what you get. Now back to your original programming. And this week's showstopper is Jaden Atari. Thank you so much, Boo, for all your love and support. I love your freaking Junko. I freaking love Junko. She is my main hoe. She's my main waifu. I love her so much. Thank you so much, Boo, for all your love and support. It means the world to me. Thank you. But thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe. Make sure to like this video. Let me know if you enjoyed it. And let me know which Disney-inspired dormitory do you think is going to be next. Click that notification bell so you get notified every time I make a video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for joining my Weave family. I love you very much, and I'll see you next time. Bye!